Detective Yamazaki. At ease. Hmm. What is this? We got the call at midnight. The parking lot attendant discovered the body. His identity? Well, he had his driver's license on him. Suzuki Kanji. Birth date. Huh? Born in 1972. It sure doesn't look it. Anyway, send it in for an autopsy. Yes, sir. I've never seen anything like this. Where did they go? That's strange. Where are they? What's wrong, dear? Well... Have you seen my glasses anywhere? I can't find them. Mm-hmm. Huh? How did they get there? Huh? So, uh, Stomu passed his admissions exams? <sighs> the results are posted today. We don't know yet, so please try to keep your mouth shut, will you? You're making me more nervous than I am. Your time's up. He's actually taking this seriously. What a bore. What a tactless girl. Have you ever done this before? No, I participated in many medical experiments, but... Is that right? You must have had to suffer at times. Yes, yes, it's like getting a really high fever or like getting a really bad rash. That's terrible. Well, not to worry. We maintain very high safety standards. Quite the setup. Gomez? If the ingredients solidify, then I can make pills. Right now, I still have to administer them directly into the blood. Let me introduce you to the subject of my experiments, Mr. Mori. We cannot fail this time. Ms. Raby supports my research. <laughs> For now. All right. Tell her I'll look into it right away.
Are you awake now? Don't just take over like that, you hear me? Don't do that! Today's a very important day for me! What am I doing here? Shh! Someone's watching us. Who? Quiet! Why? Guys. Oh no, I've got to get somewhere. One, four, three, nine. Too bad. I guess you failed. It's unfortunate, but think of it as the limit of your ability. You need this when you're down. Here. Wow, do you always keep that with you? It all depends on the time and the place. Hey, you guys! <coughs> I'm not sorry! What's this about the time and place? Will you grow up? Now, this is the best way to feel better when you're feeling down. You all failed? The two of us certainly passed, but unfortunately, he didn't. Well, life's tough. You'll have your day. <laughs> One day. See ya. Your number's not there? Hmm, well, actually, I haven't, um, checked. <laughs> what? Well, I'll go take a look for you. What's the number? One, four, three, nine. Oh, how humiliating! Side, <laughs> I'll get into some second-rate school. I didn't think I was going to pass anyway. It's no big deal. <laughs> it's there! Done well, Stone. Who are you talking to? Are you feeling okay, Tsomu? Oh, uh, it's it's nothing really. Uh, well, uh, uh, oh no! What the? What the? <gasps> oh, what are you doing to me, you idiot? Sorry, I'm not well. It's the ex exam and all. <laughs> she hates me. You're hopeless. <clears throat> that hurt. 
heart. What do you mean? You can't just control my body like that. I can't allow that. Lighten up. I was just playing around. No harm done. I'm talking about this morning. How come I had to go to Ikibukuro this morning? You and your alien games. What do you mean? This is about aliens. Nothing to do with humans. So count me out. Look. I don't know much of what this is about, and I don't want to know. But aren't you just looking for revenge? No, that's not true. Mm, I've had enough of you. Just go away. I want you to leave my body and leave Earth. Think you are becoming an even more superior being. <laughs> he has high expectations about his test subject. We cannot afford any mistakes. Hikawa is moving too fast with this. It's premature to say that the ingredients of the serum are ready. These experiments will help then. Don't we now have the perfect subject? The girl we saw this morning is just right. Very hard to catch. Huh. More than Bachelors and Giga can handle. That was due to their carelessness. You can't deny that the solution is perfectly clear. A better subject and to rid ourselves of the Federation officer. It's an opportunity to kill two birds with one stone, don't you think? Certainly it is. Then, I'll leave it up to you. It seems that he was some sort of drug addict. That's what I suspected. I've never seen a victim looking like that. Hmm, no external wounds. But one thing for certain is that there is an abnormality with his thyroidal hormones. But there's one more thing. What is it? The brain seems to have shriveled. Huh? This is a normal human brain. And here's the victim's brain. You can see that the cerebrum has shrunk by two-thirds. Also, you can see that the cerebellum is enlarged. AR reptilian complex. Our what? It's proof that humans are mere animals. It's the region that's also known as a dinosaur brain. Why would there be such a thing in a human brain? It's the region most responsible for the attack instinct and very useful for totalitarian control. There has even been research using drugs to enlarge the brain. Research? What for? To design fierce and obedient soldiers. It seems the military was doing all sorts of human experiments during the war. Do you know where we can find material on those experiments? Well, either the documents were destroyed at war's end, or the other theory is that the Americans confiscated them. Oh, we'll have to find people who were involved in this. We're talking 50 years ago. How are we going to do that? You've got good, strong legs. You shouldn't have a problem. <sighs> I understand. I'm sorry for calling so late. I'm Senkawa, and I'd like to speak to Miss Natsumi. Stomu! Dinner's mm. ready! Here goes. Good evening! I, my name is Senkawa, and I was with your daughter in junior high. Uh, is Natsumi... Oh, 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 Natsumi. 
I'm really sorry. About this morning, I was ill. Don't take me the wrong way. Mm, you still mad at me? Don't worry about it. Oh! <sighs> hey, what's wrong? Natsumi? Hello? Natsumi? Oh, sorry. Uh, well, actually, do you think you could come here right away? My family's What's all wrong? away, and I'm here all by myself, and there's a strange man hanging outside my window. I I'm scared. I'm here all by myself, and there's a strange man. So, how did Stomu do? Stomu? I guess that says it all. Really, dear? You know, dear, at times like this, it's best to leave them alone. But... But... Whoa, look at this. What an amazing spread. A celebration? How old do you think I am, Dad? I see. Then what's the occasion? It's to celebrate Tsomu passing his exam. What else? What? Really? I should call up the police. Stay inside. Sumi's watching. We can't. Come on. If you die, I die as well. No, idiot! What are you going to do now? <laughs> Don't you try to escape! Hey! What about Natsumi? We have to deal with this first! him. What? This 
horses. Bernie! Hey, you're on the ball. What's this? We'll see. All right, begin. have psi power. You must come from a lowly planet. It's a shame that you work for Ravi. Possibly be human. human after all. What's this about? Explain yourself. Just a little experiment I was trying out. Though apparently I have to work on it some more. You're a human being, aren't you? What are you trying to accomplish by treating people like that? <laughs> we'll see. Me? Ugh. It's you. I have this to say to you. Ravi cannot be stopped by a Federation officer. 
Stay away from Cristella Ravi. Try and stop me. Next time it won't be just your arm. Think about it. Are you all right? Stoma, could you please take me to the shuttle? Even the Earth is now entangled in this incredible alien confusion. It's better now. Next time I see him, I'll tear him to pieces. Right. Does that mean you're going to help me, Stomo? Isn't that the only way? You know, I appreciate it. But could we... What is it? Could we be more careful? We only really have one body. That's right. I guess it doesn't really look good to switch like that right in front of Natsumi. Oh no! That's right! What am I going to do? Let's see. Um, I'm sure it'll all work out. I really hope so, Bertie!